That was quick. I kind of like this one, I guess. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, it's still going. On a harsh desert planet. Okay. Boy, it's really going. But what's going with what's going on with stable diffusion? It's just like instant. <laughs> instant. Ah. You're not giving me time to get back to my. <laughs> It looks like No Man's Sky. There, let's skip that. There we go. Um, I'm not a fan of that particular. What? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Let's see if that adds anything to it because we kind of rejected the last one. Mm -hmm. um, these look like they're all going to be cool, so hold up. see that it's a desert planet that's really cool it's crazy this one you can't tell it's a desert planet but that's really cool anyways we're saving it this one's cool I like the thrusters on that second ship there all right boy this stable diffusion On a junkyard planet. <laughs> Let's try that. It's just going to be so quick. This is crazy. Why? Why are you going so quick? Don't do it. Oh, look at this. It's actually cool. My game's not going to look like this. <laughs> Just letting you know. It might look like some of these things. I don't know. I have no idea. I have no idea what my game is going to look like. so quick right now. Stable diffusion is quick right now. I don't know if I'm a fan of any of these, but this one looks interesting. Okay, <laughs> without, without those ones. Organic and technological merging together. 
What did I ask it for that one? I think I asked, this is a different uh, query to chat GPT. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Sorry, I just kind of started and went right into it. Welcome to the stream. How is everybody, everybody doing? Uh, hmm. Is that PowerShell? <laughs> it looks like PowerShell. Oddly enough, I don't like that one. I like, that's the only one I like. We might add from orbit on this one. Okay, so in addition to doing this stuff, what we were doing before. I'm waiting for bread to rise, and that's what I'm doing in C. Okay, so from the last stream, those of you tuning in, what happened was I, I typed in this prompt, this one right here, and it disappeared. I thought I lost it, so I was going to look at the stream and take a screenshot, come back in and type it in. I came back to this conversation, and what I typed in was here. Magically. <laughs> so anyways, it gave me this really great thing, and I just put it in. Okay, so. All right, so let's... Let's let that work in the background here. Okay. Okay, here's the thing. Um, how do I determine the hardware and software requirements? Because I know my own computer and what... Okay, so, boop. Unity latest version, what? Why? Why would you say that? Why do they need Visual Studio Code and a text editor? Why do you need a text editor to run the game? What the, this is the, so far the stupidest response. Why do you need Photoshop, GIMP, or software? What? Okay, I am confused. Let's just copy this. Wait, let's copy all of this. I think it's confused with the development versus the actual Core i5 or equivalent. Let's not even guess at Windows 7 and 8. Let's just Windows 10, 64-bit. 10, 30. No, we need very, very little storage space. Um, right now I'm going to go 100 megabytes. I'm not even going with, yeah. There. That's the first failure that I've seen. Like, complete failure of ChatGPT to quote-unquote understand what's going on. But really, it doesn't have to understand it. I just, I fed it. What did I say? I am running a Windows 10. I didn't say for development. So maybe that would have. Yeah, okay. Interesting. That's, that's interesting. Hmm. 
11 minutes. We're waiting for bread to rise, so I'm a little bit on the timer, watching the timer. Okay, so let's put that in there, and then we'll come up with this. Describe. What other tools? <laughs> Technologies use what else? Ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> it sounds like. Why does it say it sounds like? That's very interesting. But whatever. This should be an interesting part of the conversation as well. Excuse me. See what it says to that. This is really cool. I like how it actually advised me on that. I wouldn't necessarily say significant resources, but at least one other person. 
I would need at least one other person uh, to help me troubleshoot everything that has to do with multiplayer. Oh, final thoughts, future plans, potential challenges and risks. Ris risks. <laughs> um, so let's look at Thor's uh, thing here. Oh wait, what do we got? Oh look at this! Futuristic cityscape with glowing neon lights. Oh that's cool. Hold up. Ba -ba -ba. That one's not my favorite. I don't even know if I should save it. Ah, oh, we're fine. We saved it. It's fine. It's safe. It's fine. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Retro sci-fi style with analog technology. Interesting how it gets these uh, inputs. Okay, that's going to happen relatively quickly. What was I looking for? Oh yeah, Thor's uh, pirate software. Game design document. So what haven't we included here? Primary mechanic, theme design. The controls. The game experience controls. Okay, hold on. We'll just put in the stuff from his document that we haven't touched on. Development timeline. That's cool. Inspiration. Platform. Development software. Don't I have all that included? Development software. We just touched on that genre. Target audience. Gameplay overview. Theme interpretation. Primary mechanics. We don't have a theme, but game experience UI controls development timeline. That could be like a log. Minimum viable product. I'm very curious what ChatGPT would say about that. So let's start with this one. I know we got game development controls coming up, but let's jump to this one just to see what happens. Those are my only thoughts. We'll see what Chad GPT comes up with. Oh wait, what?
Set up the development environment, including the required tools. Implement basic gameplay mechanics, player movement, basic trading, AI for NPCs. Add the 3D voxel worlds, create basic terrain generation, implement basic collision detection and physics. Add sound effects and background music in the game. Add in-game UI elements, menus, work on the visual interface. Interesting. Um, see if that does anything. This is better. This is much better. Okay, that's fine. I don't think I left anything out now. Game experience controls. 
Let's look at what Staple Diffusion has now. That was quite a little bit there. Retro sci-fi style with analog technology. <laughs> what in the world? Okay, I like Stable Diffusion. I know that Mid Journey is better, but that's money. Money that I don't want to spend. I have money now, but I don't want to spend it. So. Interesting. I wouldn't say those are my favorite, but that's definitely interesting. This one should be interesting. Okay. So for the final one here, where are we at? Conclusion, we're on the conclusion. This would be great because then I, tomorrow I can spend my time doing uh, laundry, which at this point is an optional thing which I really want to get it done, which would be great. And shopping, a little bit of shopping. I do have to go to Aberdeen and back, which is about 20 minutes away for uh, shopping for shoes, because I'm on my feet all day. I need better shoes. And then buy some stuff to make, to have some stuff to take to work.
Okay, cool. I know it sounds like someone's talking to me in this one, but that's fine. We're just gonna boop. Oh, I kind of covered that in future plans for the game in the uh, previous one. Final thoughts on the game design. 32 minutes, we should probably go put bread in the oven. But let me do this next question. numbered and I forgot to look okay I was like what's going on I would be willing to spend some money for somebody with uh, some decent music or better that they want to share and make money on of course that's almost like it. it's almost like a complete independent person because you can make your own money as the selling the album you know for the game Oh, here we go. Let's talk about this. I think we've already seen some of these. Let's just let chat be GPT take care of that. I don't think we're going to have to worry too much about number one because that's our main focus. Number two is, is fine. We're doing this totally while I'm working to make money to pay off all my debt. That's fine. We're not spending a lot of money, so three isn't an issue. For the main thing with that, um, the only people I'm going to bring on are going to be music people. And they are, like I said, they're their own thing. The album is going to be separate. So I'm not going to be, I mean, there, there might be a little bit of share as far as their money. But if they make their own album for my game, I'm going to make money from their album being in my game. And they can make money from their album being separate. So... I'm not really worried about the team dynamics. I might bring some people on who know Steam API Twitch integration, but that's just going to be really straightforward. I can learn that with ChatGPT. Marketing, user adoption, once games clean and you sure it's market effectively, it's going to be challenged for the crowd of marketing, and that's the marketing interest. Yeah, I think number five is the only viable one. I'm just going to copy that one as the, as the one thing. Because everything else is just kind of 
I'm kind of not conquering those things, but not worried about those things at the same time. So. Nice. That is beautiful. Hey MC, welcome back. How's it going? I just decided to readdress the uh, the finish of this, and I think I got to the end of the game design document. Good feeling. Good feeling. What did we get here? What? Cosmic landscapes with vibrant colors and patterns. <laughs> I bet you you queue that up more than once so you'll get something different. So let's just save all these here. I'm about to end stream, so welcome. Because I am hungry. I had a little bit to drink. Played some Smite. Worked on this, did a few stable diffusion things. Good. Yeah, it's really, it's going well. Tomorrow I'm going to spend maybe some time after shopping and stuff, and I'm going to do some game development. Uh, get, get, I'm going to review the whole game design document tonight. Look at how many 539 lines that ChatGPT has helped me come up with for this, for this game, which is really cool. A lot of it was stuff that I've already thought about, but a lot of it is stuff that I just needed to think a little bit more about. And I think I just need to review everything. Maybe I'll do that later tonight, but I'll probably fall asleep. Another word for that is pass out. <laughs> I'll probably pass out. But how's your night going, man? So let's close down Stable Diffusion. Let's take a look here. I think what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to go ahead and raid Mr. Wiggly because he's still on. He is a really cool uh, modded Minecraft player. Let's see what we get here. Ready to raid. Two, one. Raid now. Boom. Let's turn off my stream. <laughs> 